why did you go out every day? So did you miss your father? You got your brother still seven years old. Supposed to be, he's still in the house, like playing or doing something, studying. But now you're, you're here. How old is your mother? Welcome to our YouTube channel. It's me, Roger, and welcome to Roger in SME Vlog. So today we have a special guest, and these are the kids that um, also room around every day to ask uh, food or rice. And I saw them, and I decided to uh, give something for them. And but before that. Um, Again, salamat sa inyong pagigugma o pagsuporta sa among channel. Thank you so much for the love and support, guys. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe. And hit the bell icon for new uploads or new videos. So what I'm gonna do right now, I'm going to ask um, them what's their situation, why they have to go out every day to ask food or a rice. What is your name? Jomo. And how old are you? Twelve. Twelve years old. And is he your brother? Yes. And what is his name? John Rio Roland. And how old is he? Seven. Seven years old. Okay. So are you still schooling? Six. Grade six. And what about him? Grade one. Grade one. So you'll be turning grade six this opening? Yes. And him will be grade two or grade one? One. Grade one. Okay. So why did you go out every day? Uh, ayo. kinanglan man ninyo mugawas every day? Wala mami pang palit o pagkao na mo niya. Yes, lang mama naman ang mudiga mo sa balay. Kami kay mga ayo matay may bugas mo. Si Paguna may anang negro ba? Amo so okay. Mm, okay. So according to him, they went out to ask food or rice so that uh, their mother have something to cook. Okay. So where is your mother right now? Asa imong mama? Nas balay. Okay, why she didn't want to like work instead you guys asking food or rice every day? Nanong dili man siya ang mo trabaho instead ka mo ang mo mugawasig pangayo every day. Nagtrabaho man siya sa una niya. Kaya silang mama manug apply pa mag trabaho niya. Trabaho man may dila sa una sa may magarita extension niya. Ibuat-buatan man silang Sala sa ikson sa amo nilang mama. Okay. So, he said that her mother is working before. But the thing is, there will be some problem. So, she went out. And then, right now, her mother is trying to find a job. How old is your mother? 30. 30 years old. Still young. So, she can still work, right? So, pwede pa siya mo trabaho. Okay ra niya nga mo gawas mo everyday? Nga mga ayaw o pagkaon? Pero panalag sa hiram po ko mga ayaw o bugas yan. Arang mahotdan mi ba? Pero mo ato ko permit ito sa guys ano? Mga ayaw. Okay. According to him, he only ask rice if they don't have rice anymore to cook. So he just went outside to room around. Um, and other than that, um, every time if there is no more rice, so that's the time that they will ask rice, ask uh, go to other go to have some houses here in San Carlos and you know ask for for rice. I hope that your mother will find uh, or try to find a job so that. Uh, she can support you. How how many siblings do you have? Pila mo kubok ikso on? Opat. 
Pat Mukbukig, so on. So, uh, he's the youngest. Uh, he's the youngest. What about you? So, where are your other siblings? Asa yung ubani mong igsoon? Ang ako ang ako ang among katulong manghod na asa mong tita sa ilo-ilo. Hmm, okay. I know what uh, she doing there. Ang sayang gibuhat dito sa ilo-ilo. Ah, uh, mga aran tita ka pa eskwela sa kong manghod niya katulog. Okay, she goes to school. Her tita supported her to to go to school. Okay. Asa makaga eskwela ka ron? Sa Greenville Elementary School. Greenville Elementary School. Okay. So, you always here in Margarita? Permi ka dari sa Margarita? Analag sa rak. Mga ayok o bugas. Asa saan mo mo ato aside dari sa Margarita? If you don't have rice, uh, where do you gonna go aside from the, this place? Mo ba? Mo ma... Human ko dari nga side. Mo ato ko dari sa Donovan. Dike ito sa... Juan, St. Vincent. Okay. So what if fully mohatag? What if no one will give you rice? Na araman di sa gamera go nya. Na arang makaon ba? Okay. In a week, how many kilo of rice that you can consume? Pila ka kilo ang inyong mahorot sa usa ka semana? Na amo sa na dua ka kilo. Sa usa ka semana? Oh. So he said that um, you can only consume two kilos. Um, Per week. So, pila mo kabok na ngaon? Lima. Kuwanda ka kilo, duha ang yung makonsum. So, kulang rana kung lima mo kabok. That's not enough if you if there will be five people in your house. Bajito naman po na mong bugas sir kay ma mahok dan ni. Bajit bajito rana mong bugas. Okay, that's difficult. So he said that. Uh, there will be five people eating, and all they need to do is to consume the two kilos of rice in a week. So that's pretty hard. And these people that uh, staying with you and with your mother, they're already adults. So what are their jobs? So, wala sila salary? They don't have any salary? Wala. So, nag-apply pa man sila. Okay. So, they're still looking for a job. So, I just hope that uh, they could find, or especially your mother could find a, a job, so that you will not go out every day to ask uh, rice, so that uh, you have rice, or food to eat every day. So this school opening, you still have to go to school or you have to stop? Okay, so he said that he will continue schooling and then after the class, he will be going to Gaisano. So what are you doing there in Gaisano? Mangayo po ni. Mangayo. So he said uh, he will be asking food. So nasa mo hata ginyo? Na aman. Okay. So did you also ask money? Nangayo sa mo kwarta? Ah. Oh. And then if you ha already have money, what are you gonna do for the money? Yatag na mo sa mama. Okay. And then your mother will buy rice? Oh. Wow, that's a really hard um, situation. Oh, by the way, where, where is your father? Asa imong papa? Nasa Manila. Nasa Manila, okay. Nagtrabaho imong papa? Did your father work? Naa, panda niya. Bulag naman silang mama kay nag-edad pa ko tres kay... Ang ato siya Manila kay Manarbao niya. Nakita mo siyang mama nga nahilain bayi sa Facebook. Mm, okay, so he said uh, his father is in Manila. 
he has a job, but the thing is, her mother and him already broke up, and uh, her mother saw him on Facebook that uh, he has already uh, a family. So, nana siya lang familia dito. Kasado imong mama ug papa is your mother and father married or no? Dili. Okay. And also he said that when he was uh, three years old, his father left, went to Manila to, to find a job. Pero karo na support ayapon imong papa. So your father still supporting you, giving you money. Wala man. His father didn't support them, didn't give anything or money. And um, do you have uh, contact with him? Na mo contact si mong papa? Wala. Dili naman, dili naman mo contact mo contact si si mama sa iya. Okay. So he said her mother won't contact him anymore because of the situation that he has already a family. So did you miss your father? Giming ako si mong papa. Wala kayo. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. So he said that uh, he didn't miss his father because uh, his father is a irresponsible guy. He left them when they were young. Wow. Very sad. Supposed to be. Your father is happy right now with you because you're grown up already. You're big. So, and this is the time that uh, you guys need support from, from him. But uh, the situation is he left. What if, Mubalik Imong Papa, what if your father will come back and do you still accept him? Dili na. Ano man, why? Amo ano lang man, amo ano ang mama ang patiwasan. Pwede ako, samtang wala pa na ang pa. Samtang wala na sila ni papa. So, he won't accept his father, guys, because of what he did. And he will just sacrifice. And up until, since their mother is still there. And like I said earlier, that... I hope your mother can find a job in order for her to, to support you guys. Because look at your brother. So look at your brother, still seven years old. Supposed to be he's still in the house, like playing or doing something, studying. But now you're, you're here outside to, to ask for rice or money. It's very difficult at your age. So, are you like jealous to other kids that uh, they have a complete family? They have a mother and a father. Nagsilos ka nga sa ubang mga bata nga na ay nasilay mga ginikanan. Wow, so sad. So, unsa imo hang wish para ni mo unsa imo mga ikso-on? I wish na na tagaan ni blessing tagaan lang sa ginoo. So I ask uh, him guys uh, what is his wish and for for their uh, brother and siblings. So he said that um, he wished that uh, God will give them blessings every day. Oh by the way, what time did you like went outside? What time did you leave your house? What time mo ni Bia sa inyong balay? Mga last otso. They left 8 in the morning, guys, to to walk and then ask for food. And did you eat your breakfast already? Hmm, nangapi mi daat. What about rice? Did you eat rice, no? Wala. So, they just drink coffee? And then walk outside. Now it's uh, 12 noon, so you don't have breakfast and, and lunch. So for sure you are hungry, especially your brother. Are you hungry? Gutom na ka? 
uh, he said um, he's hungry guys now um, I'll see you next time time right now is already 12 noon so it's lunch already and since you don't have breakfast and lunch um, I bought a Jollibee for you guys so that you can eat together with your brother and uh, before you go home I also give you rice okay so that uh, you have something to cook so are you happy right now yes okay that's good so guys uh, here's the, the Jollibee the food for them for their lunch and also I give them uh, rice as well Actually, they're still here since uh, early in the morning. So, dong dara ang kwan. Here's the the jelly bee. They naik sud na sa and also the rice. Okay. So you can eat your lunch na. You have to eat your lunch, okay? Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. So guys, I think that's pretty much about it. Thank you so much for watching till the end. And uh, I hope to see you in our next video. No hate, just love, lovely people. Bye, say bye.